going to be making ice cream rolls. That's right, so we're going to be making ice cream rolls. Right? Rolling the ice cream. So you've got a, a machine here that you can actually make rolled ice cream with, right? Right. We'll turn it on. That yeah. way it can cool off. Okay, so first we've got to get our ice cream mix ready. Let's go right here. And right here we have heavy whipping cream that we're going to pour into the bowl. Okay. Just like this. Okay, so it looks so thick. It is. So that is how many ounces does it say on the side? It is. It's 14 ounces of, or 1 pint, 16 ounces of whipping cream. And then you've got to use sweetened condensed milk, which is right there, right in the can of that. Right. How many ounces of that is there? Um, 14 ounces. 14 ounces of that. So pour it right in. Let's go ahead and pour it right in. And she's got to get all of it off the sides, right? Right. Just like that. So the first thing we're going to make is some super yummy strawberry ice cream with really good strawberries, like healthy, a little healthy snack. Well, healthy with strawberries. It does still have ice cream in it, and it will taste like really good ice cream. Yeah. Assistant, have you made any of these rolled ice creams before? I have. And the second one we're going to make is we're actually going to make Oreo, which I've tried before, and it's so good. Super good. All right, so we've made every, we've done all that. Okay. Now we are going to whisk it. Yep, so you're going to whisk that up, and then we're going to get a half a cup of it out, and we're going to put it on our ice cream roller, right? Right. All right, so we've gotten it all whisked up. And we're not going to use all that. We can save some of that for later, right? Right. right. So we get a half a cup, and we're just going to dip it in there, and get a get this this is how much ice cream we're going to make okay so a half a cup which is eight ounces and then you're going to put it right on the surface right just like that all right good 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 all right and we like to chill our our, our this right here our, the, the ice cream mix before we put it out just to make it a little easier to do right yeah and all of our ingredients that we use to make the things were cool yeah all right so now she's going to get some strawberries and probably like three or four, right? Because you gotta chop, yeah, chop, good. chop them up. So this is gonna be like strawberry ice cream. Yeah, well, that's the reason why we got strawberries. <laughs> Alright, so let's start chopping them. Ah. Alright, so you gotta hold them kind of one of them in place and then just kind of. Maybe go to the. There you go. So you, you cut it into small pieces and then you chop it all the way up. Right? right. One more big one. So let's cut that thing up, right? Now we're just gonna keep mixing this. And we're just gonna push all of these to the side, get it all in one place, and then we're gonna flip it, and then we're gonna mix it even more. That way it's super mixed and it will be really good. Okay. So keep chopping. You gotta make it into fine because you have to spread it really thin to roll it, right? Right. Because if it's in chunks, it won't be able to go very thin and then we wouldn't be able to roll it. Yep. And you also want it thin, that way it can freeze all the way. And you want to do it as fast as you can, not necessarily hard, but just be fast. Be fast, but you can see it's getting thicker, right? All right, so we're almost done. We're just going to flip it one more time, and then we're going to mix it up. We've got to chop it a lot more, though, right? Yep. So keep chopping. All right. Alrighty, we're almost done chopping it up. You kind of want to keep it away from the edges, that way it can stay nice. Yeah, this ice cream roller, the edges aren't quite as cold as the center, right? Right, so it would be better if you just keep the mix in the center. Alright. 
It's looking really pink. It sure is. All right, Sandy, spread it out a little bit. All right. And you got to make it really thin. It definitely needs to be chopped up a little bit more. Yeah. So now, sister, what are you doing? I am pressing it down, the spatula thingy down. That way, it can squish the strawberries at the same time and make it super thin. That's right, like a paste, right? Right. So you're making the paste, and then we're going to make it nice and thin, and we're going to start to roll the ice cream. So this is kind of a real important step, right? You have to make it as thin as possible. All right, we're almost done. All right, and you got your other spatula where you can kind of scrape it. There's a little bit of ice cream on it, right? And then you want clean spatulas. For the rolling. For the rolling. I think that's pretty good spray being spread out. I agree. Look because at how... it's not really sticking to these anymore. So now we're going to see. Is it, is it frozen yet? It's getting close. All right, so we're going to give you a spatula. We're going to take spatula. And, and we're, we're going to start to clean it. So now we wait for it to freeze. Yep, we're just waiting for it to freeze. And then look, so you see how it looks like a paste. And do you, you see how fine all the strawberries are? Ooh, look at Yummy. that. All right, let's look at it and see. Do you think it's getting close to being frozen enough? Um, maybe a couple more seconds. But I mean, we can draw our lines. Sure. So we gotta make sure there's one. So you draw a line so you know where to roll it, right? Right. We can, I think we can make three. Okay. All right. I think it's good. You think it's frozen enough? All right, let's see, you, see if you can do it. Well, I think let's get off the edges. That way we can have okay. a place to roll it. Okay. There we go. Let's get that away from the edge. <laughs> and whoa. That's perfect! Oh, you make no. a perfect ice cream roll! Right, so there it is. Use the tongs and we can pick it up and put it in the bowl. Alright, so there it is. Here we go. So look at that. Look at this super cool roll of ice cream. Let's go to the next Let's one. Let's go to the next one. Whoa, look at it roll, people at home. Isn't that awesome? Yeah, we don't even need to help it. Wow. Okay, let's get this. Now you get the tongs and we're going to put that in here. So here's the bowl. Here's our second roll of ice cream. Wow, isn't that perfect? Now for the third and final one. Yep. This one's, the edges are always usually a bit harder. Oh, and another perfect roll. All right, grab it and let's put it in the cup. All right, and what? Look at that, that perfect ice cream roll. Here, you hold it. Oh my goodness, this is great! Well, look at that ice cream roll. So that is how you can make a healthy ice cream treat, right? Right. With fresh strawberries. Now we're gonna make a not as healthy Oreo treat, right? Right! Okay, so, so let's see how it looks now. We added a little strawberry. And we added a spoon. Yeah, and you can try a bite. And if you want to, you can add a little strawberry sauce or whipped cream or anything else that you want to it, right? Right. So that is how we make strawberry ice cream. But now we've got three Oreos, just the tops or bottoms, and we're gonna make Oreo ice cream, right? Right, but first we have to clean off our surface. Yeah, kind of start from you, right? Right. All right, let's get ready and you'll see our Oreo ice cream next. So now it's just that we're gonna make Oreo ice cream, right? And right. It's, it's real important for us to tell people about the science and how this actually works. Okay, so why don't you go ahead and get your half a cup of mix. Dip it in. And you pour it out, right? So right now we've got a liquid and we're putting it on the super cold surface and that will freeze it into a solid. So that's why you have to turn it so that all the different surfaces of that mix actually freezes. All right, so now we're just gonna put a little bit of chocolate Just a little bit of chocolate sauce, not a whole lot, right? That's too little. Yeah, just there, that's plenty. Right? So she's made a little smiley face, and now she's <laughs> going to get her Oreos. We're only going to use 
this too. And we learned a trick is you break them up in your hands before you actually put it on there. So you kind of crush it in your hand and you spread it on, right? Like that. And then she's going to get the other one. Of course she washed her hands. I did. So now she's going to do this one. The same thing. She's just going to really kind of just... And now she's going to take her spatula and start chopping it up and mixing it. So all the different surfaces have to touch the metal and that's what freezes it. Okay, here we go. Get it all into the middle. Yep, I'm doing it. So you put it toward the middle. You're mixing like like cake batter almost too, right? Kinda. You're doing a great job. More towards the middle. Part of it is frozen, but part of it is not. So now we just need to. Get it off the side and then start spreading it around with your spatula. Just like this, and this one will be a little bit easier to spread because it's not as like chunky as the strawberries. Yeah, we tasted the strawberry ice cream. It was super <laughs> good. It tasted like real strawberry ice cream because it was made of real strawberries. Yeah, like when you go to a place and they have real strawberry milkshakes, it tasted like that, except it's ice cream. Rolls. It is. It was ice cream rolls too. So yeah. She spread it out nice and thin. And I don't think you don't really want to add a bunch of chocolate sauce because I think that affects on how you roll it, on how it rolls. So we're almost done with the spreading parts. Almost. Wow, it looks really good. All right. We just need to get this little part right here, and then I think we'll be ooh, good to have it freeze. Okay, sister, so it looks like it's nice and smooth, right? So now we're doing the lines. Good job. We can actually make a little bit more because we spread it out a little bit better. Yeah, it looks like it's a little thinner this time, right? So now right. she's going to start to roll it. Sometimes they roll easy, and sometimes they need a little help. So this time it looks like the assistant's got to give it a little help to roll. Yeah, like the last time it was surprisingly easy. Yeah, the strawberry stuff looked pretty easy. We're going to try not to touch it with our hands because it make it easier. All right, so that's one of our rolls. Pretty good, pretty good. Now we'll put it in our Hand me the bowl and I'll hold the bowl for you. Go. So this is the first roll. I'll buy you some room. It's kind of falling down. Now she's making the second one. Oh good, good. There we 
There we go. Right, let's use the tongs and put it in the bowl. So this is ice cream roll number two. Here we go. All right, good job. Now ice cream roll number three. Right, so here's number three. And then I think we'll, we'll just leave it at three. And then we're gonna garnish it so you can see how cool it looks. When it's done. Here's the third one. Oh, this one's so good. Oh, you're holding above the camera, so I couldn't see it. There you go. Those were so good. Why don't you roll one more, assistant? All right. Wait one second, and then we're going to roll that last one. Okay. Bum -ba -da -dum. Bum -ba -da -dum. So, assistant, do you have a favorite kind that we've made so far? And Oreo. But Oreo. the strawberry ones were really good. Ready? Yep. Here we go. There we go. Almost done. Whoa! Yeah. <laughs> it flipped. That's why you don't roll it towards yourself, right? Right. All right. We're All right. So now we're just going to garnish it and see what we can make with our Oreos. So here are the three. Now that's some, we made. Now you got some Oreo cookies there, and you're going to kind of put those on, right? They're strategically. Like that. And if you want, you can put a little chocolate sauce on it. Super awesome. And then add your spoon. Your spoon. And then that is your Oreo ice cream rolls. Now, since we're going to do a fun series called The Assistant's Ice Cream Igloo, right? Right. And we're going to make all kinds of fun ice cream things. But so make sure you see that. Make sure you subscribe to our channel. Subscribe. Only 5% of you are subscribed. And we need you all to subscribe, right? All so we can get to 5 million and possibly 10 million. That's right. So like this video, subscribe to our channel, and uh, look at that yummy ice cream. Yummy. All right, everyone. Thanks for watching. Bye.